Hi guys, in this video I'll show you how to set up your E3 total station using the coordinate method. So first you set up your device over your desired point and then you level. Ensure the curved side of your total station is facing your left as you face the total station. This is to ensure that the measurements you take in that position are face left measurements. Then go to the memory. and then select the job. I'll select a job that has no data in it. After selecting a job, we then click on menu and then select coordinate and then we'll select occupation, orientation and then occupation coordinate. You then type in your designation for the point and other parameters. Be sure to measure the height of your instrument that is the height of your total station and then fill in the accurate data on your total station When you're done filling the data, you click on OK and then you click on Backsite. On this page, you fill in the data, the coordinates, designation and target height for your target point. So be sure to take the height of your pole and then fill in the data as your target height. You then fill in all other coordinate information.
and then you click on OK. You rotate your device to your target point. and then you measure as you can see it has been measured you click on OK and then you can click on measure again to see the coordinates that the device has measured for that orientation point that is the back site as you can see from the documentation the coordinates provided are very close to that which the device measured We can then go on from here to measure other points on site with our device. So that is how you set up your total station using the coordinate method. Thanks guys for sticking with us, um, if you liked the video please do well to drop a like and a comment on what you'd like to see in our subsequent videos. Also don't forget to share, please be kind enough to follow us on our different um, social media platforms. See you next time.